This is Alex from HomeTrainingGym.com and in this video I'm going to give you five different dumbbell exercises that you should probably add to your workouts. Alright, real quick, before we begin, be sure to like and subscribe, that way you don't miss out on any videos like this one. Uh, I do different exercises, quick reviews, things like that, so there should be a little picture of me, uh, icon, the bottom right or left hand corner that you can hit the subscribe button on. Alright, so let's get into the five dumbbell exercises. First one is going to be a hollow press. All right, so for this, you're gonna get into a hollow body. Once you get to the hollow body, you're gonna have two dumbbells. All right, so you're gonna hold one up, and then the other one you're gonna press with. All right, so before you get to the hollow body, put one on one side, one on the other. But get into the hollow body here, so lower back should be touching the floor, shoulders should be off the floor, and then from there, you're gonna grab both dumbbells, hold them up, and then you're gonna press. All right, one at a time. Elbow should be touching the ground, still holding a good hollow position, and then pressing straight up. So that's going to be the hollow body press. Alright, so next exercise is going to be a squat overhead press. So you're going to get into the bottom of a squat, have your dumbbell, and then from there, so I'm in the squat, and all I'm going to do is just hold the squat while I press overhead, come back down. Alright, we want to press, turn if we can, come back down press. Alright, and so that's going to be the overhead squat press. Alright, next dumbbell movement is going to be the clean jerk. So on the clean jerk, you're still going to only need one dumbbell. Alright, from there, feet are going to be outside your hips. You're basically going to do uh, kind of like a kettlebell swing in order to clean the dumbbell up, and then you're going to jerk it overhead so you'll just pop it up and then catch. Alright, so what that looks like so I'll take one dumbbell, clean it up, jerk. All right, so whenever we clean it, I want to make sure that I'm pulling straight up, all right? And I'm using more of my hips in order to get the dumbbell up to my shoulders. So what it looks like from the side, hips, jerk, and then stand it up, all right? So whenever I jerk, I'm going to dip, we're going to drive, and then we're going to re-dip to bend and catch, and then catch it overhead, stand it up. So what it comes down to, here, catch, catch, press. So that's going to be the dumbbell cleaning jerk. All right, so this is going to be the double dumbbell RDL. All right, so for this, you're going to take two dumbbells, one in each hand. Basically, what you're going to do is you're going to do an RDL. So have a slight bend in the leg with two dumbbells. You're going to go down and then you come back up. The thing to focus on is don't touch the ground. You don't have the flexibility to do it. Also, stay back on your heel. All right, so what that looks like from the side view is I'm going to go down, stay on one foot, come down, and then come up. All right, so I'm not going to go down all the way because I don't have the flexibility. And then same thing, forward view, down, come right back up. I'm bending my knee a little bit. All right, side view one more time. Slight bend, coming up. I want to make sure my, hip, my hips try to stay as square to the ground as possible so I don't want to turn and do it that way, right? So that's why we have two dumbbells. Hips stay as square as possible. I want to go down, get as low as I can, come right back up, stand back on the heel. All right, this dumbbell exercise is gonna be an overhead step up, all right? So you're gonna grab one dumbbell, hold it up overhead, and all you're gonna do is just step up. So you're gonna have a box, whatever kind of height, and then you're just gonna step, stand it up, and then come back down, all right? Come back down to the ground, up, step. All right, so we'll make sure that the dumbbell is straight over my head and it's not slightly in front or way too far back. And whenever I step, it goes to front view. I'm just going to lean forward slightly and then I'm going to press through the foot that's on the box first and then I'll come back down. All right, and then you'll switch legs and do the same thing. So I'll now do left and then come back down. And after so many reps, you can switch arms. All right, so those are five dumbbell exercises that you can add into your workouts. Again, be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on any of these types of videos, and I'll be sure to do more later on. 